Welcome to Martini Minute. I'm Michelle Collins, and joining me today, dare I say my favorite person on the planet, <laughs> Adam Lambert. You know I love you. Thank you. I love you. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I haven't seen you in a while. I know. It's been since right after the Adam finale, right? Right after the Adam finale. And actually, funny enough, uh, you're gay now. <laughs> since I've seen you, how's that been going? You wasn't gay enough for you the first time? You weren't allowed to be gay when I met you the first oh, time. Oh, I was allowed. I didn't know. I just, it was a decision. It was a choice. <laughs> Remember when I flashed you and I was like, why isn't he doing anything? <laughs> <laughs> I never did that. I did it. I did it. I know. And now you're drinking. So now what's going to happen? Well, so let's cheers, by the way, to cheers. all of your success. Since cheers. Cheers. This is a... Take a sip. Mmm. Mmm. It's fig vodka from uh, Hungary that my grandmother made. Um, this is squash the grapes. With squash the, the grapes yeah, yeah. with her labia. Yeah. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I just want to get a rise out of the guy. I just, <laughs> Talented woman, it runs through all the columns, girls. We can do magical things, magical things. Um, all right, now we have a lot to go over. I feel like I can't believe I'm actually lucky enough to talk to you. Fruits with your labia, I Me? Yeah. Well, that's fruit. You name it. Yeah, what do you hey. want? I'll make a whole fruitcake right oh now. Oh Christmas. I'll bake it in there. I'll give birth to two months from now. It'll come out in wrapping. I swear. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's it's gonna be like this all the time. You're not gonna even get to one question because I'm gonna be catching the entire time. But that's why I love you, because yeah. you make me feel important. Aww. Right, America? I'll drink to that. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Drink, take. Cheers. Cheers. Our Mixed Banks line is Mixed Banks line showing. Mm -hmm. I have nine pairs on for you. Mm, mm, mm -hmm. mm. My ankles are like three feet wide right there. <laughs> <laughs> All the fat comes right out the ankles, guys. <laughs> okay, listen, I'm sick of myself. <laughs> Talk me through the AMAs on mm. Sunday. Well, I, you know, I got ready, like, really fast last minute to do the red carpet. We were running late because, you know, it takes a minute. Mm -hmm. um, and so I just ran through the carpet, took pictures, missed Janet. Um, I was ticked about that. I left Janet. I wanted to see her. Did she show anything this time? I don't know. I haven't seen it. Uh, all right. Still haven't seen it. I've been running ever since. Okay. Um, I'll, I'll email it to you. I'll okay. just send it to you. Okay. You send it. Um, and mm -hmm. then I sat down in my seat and I watched the show up to Lady Gaga, okay. which was my highlight. With Lady Gaga, of course. Uh, with a with a uh, like a nod to Kelly Clarkson for sounding absolutely beautiful. She has a great. Uh, she sounded voice. absolutely beautiful. And she's also the nicest mm -hmm. person. Met her for the first time. Yeah. Great. Um, but, and I know that by the way you worked with Gaga on your I album. I did. I did. Yeah. I want to ask you quickly about her. When you guys hang out, well, is there we we like don't that? we don't hang you out don't unfortunately. Hang out? I would love to, but she's pretty busy. Well, Maybe eventually. Know, is she like always was wearing weird stuff? Like, yes. Yes. Always. She came into the studio the day that we did the song. In this, in the trench coat that she's wearing in the Bad Romance video, mm -hmm, with yeah. like the kind of like the letters on it, mm -hmm. she took it off and she was wearing a little black like push-up bra, mm -hmm. panties, mm -hmm. fishnet stockings, black patent leather stripper boots, and then this big like uh, like tent skirt that went out and it was um, horizontally striped with sheer and then solid and sheer and solid. Right. So I could see it, the panties, the the booty. Mm -hmm. How was it for She's you? very naked. I mean, I was looking. <laughs> yeah, sure. I was looking, and I appreciated the beauty. I think she could take her look a step further if she started wearing Tevas. I think if she could, like, Teva, like, rock climbing signals <laughs> on, people would be like, Gaga, what are you thinking? Don't you think so? Orthopedic flats. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or, like, uh, you know, there's, like, cellularly reducing sneakers. That'd, that'd be like, cool. Like, yeah. Like, anorexic Frankenstein. Yeah, like, grandma. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so, <laughs> you're in the AMA. It's now to the performance. You have rehearsal, obviously. Mm -hmm. Uh... Tell me about the show for you performing. What was that? Well, like? I mean, we rehearsed all week, and I um, I worked with an amazing creative director, and it was Stephanie, and this this choreographer named Tracy. Um, I was involved with the audition process for the dancers, picked dancers, a couple that I had worked with before, actually. What was auditioning like? Did you, like, snap their wrist straps and stuff? Um, I uh, definitely asked the guys to take their shirts off at mm -hmm. one point. Um, it's like in my sweet 16, my super sweet 16. Sure, like, yeah. yeah. I don't want that, I don't want that. <laughs> <laughs> you know when they always have the dancers, like the double sluts, have the dancers come and they're like, no, you're ugly. I mean, I was, I mean, in all honesty, I was looking for something like, you know, a sensu I mean, in all, like a sensuality and understanding of the vibe of the song. Because some dancers in LA are like, face, face, out, face, some face. Yes. And, and the ones that, that really popped out to me were the ones that understood the rhythm of the song and actually understood real sexuality, mm -hmm. not that pretentious, like, LA thing. Yeah. Um, and so we picked them. I also had an, a hand in auditioning the band. These great musicians. An old friend of mine's a guitar player. I've known him for years. Mm -hmm. um, amazing drummer, amazing keyboard player, amazing bass player. Um, the guy you made out with. He's the bass player who was doing keyboards for that song. Uh -huh. Yes. You know him from before? No. Cool. It's 
a new friend. So you like make out with like strange people you barely know? All the time. That's so weird. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> what was his, is he, uh, what's his story? He's cute. He is really cute, yeah. yeah. Straight guy. Mm -hmm. Open-minded. Married. Not married. I don't know where that rumor came from. No, oh, yeah, I read that. No, he's single. Oh, he's single. Yeah. That's good, at least. Yeah. Make anyone's wife mad. Yeah, no, I, I wouldn't. No. no, I know you're, you're, a, you're a lady like that. You would never no, I'm that. a lady like that. <laughs> um, no, no, he's he's a straight dude, musician. Yeah. His name's Tommy. Okay. He's pretty. He is very pretty. And, this, and I, I was, the spirit moved me. And, and I just went with it. The spirit moved America, apparently, because <laughs> let's, uh, the aftermath of this thing. Now, I thought the performance was, I mean, literally spaceship crazy amazing. <laughs> I bought your album. I, by the way, have been listening to Thank it. Thank you. I think it's incredible. Thank you. I truly love it. And when the song gets in my Gaga playlist, like Gaga, I hate, I hate myself. It's in my Gaga playlist. But every time a song comes on, the new song. You love that. I love so, that song. so dramatic, right? Oh, I, at times, and I mean this is an utmost compliment, you almost sound like a young Julio Iglesias. Thank you. You're very welcome. Well, thank you. <laughs> um, Gracias. You, I know, yeah. Julie. He's okay. a gorgeous man. Yeah. Okay, now GMAs, uh, GMAs. Good morning, America. What was the, what happened there exactly? I guess that be due to my racy performance on the AMAs, right. GMA, which is on the same network, yes. got a little uncomfortable mm -hmm. and were afraid that I would repeat a provocative performance for early morning television Were audiences. Were you planning on doing that? No. Even like a blurred fellatio? Nothing? <laughs> no. A little blurred fellatio? No, mm, no, I'm no. Surprised. Not a slight culling either. Kind of like a No. Not but like a pixelated No, no. <laughs> mm, all right. No, it was it was gonna it was gonna be ta toned down. There was gonna be less right. dancers. It was gonna be like minimalized and uh -huh. You know, honestly, none of the, none of the stuff that they took offense to that people were freaking out about was actually choreographed. I right. I don't I'm not the type of performer that does everything like as you're not, you're not a robot. I'm not. No. Um, you know who is? Who? Diane Sawyer. Cheers. Drink to that. No, I'm just kidding. She's America's princess. Wait, I have two more <laughs> questions for you. I have a couple more. So so what happened was I got up there and like I saw Gaga smash the whiskey bottles on the piano right. and I got inspired and I got nervous yeah. because I was like. I want to be badass like her. Yeah. Um, and so I got competitive, and so when I got up there, the adrenaline took over, and I just decided to to face crazy. the dancer. And you tomorrow know? you're on the early show instead, right, CBS? Mm -hmm. Yeah, G GMA, I guess they missed out. One last question. Uh, do you watch Glee, and are you going to be on Glee? I, I don't know. I mean, maybe when the time is right. I've seen a couple episodes. It's, right. a, it's a cool show. I, I'm a little busy. Dare you. A little, How dare little, you say that to little me? Busy. No, I would love to. I would love to. When the time is I, I when the time is right and the character yeah. is right. Yeah. The character The character, character right. has to be right. Um, by the way, my mother's reaction about the AMAs thing, she goes, as Ema used to say, Ema is my dead grandmother, yeah. fruit cake Sally. Okay. Uh, as oh. Ema used to say, uh, your generation didn't invent sex. Oh. Which I think is funny and also valid. Like everyone's freaking out about this, but really, what did you really do this on that? I, I, I don't really think it was that big of a deal. And I've been saying this, I really think there's a double standard. I think that female performers have been doing crap like that for the past 20 years, yeah. and everybody's like used to it now, and no one even blinks an eye. Well, Miley Cyrus's V hangs over a pole, and it's like, <laughs> uh, salute your shorts. I mean, it's something like Nickelodeon, awful waffles left and right, no one cares about them. And what I want to know, <laughs> salute your shorts. You know you want to I remember that show. show, I remember it. It was a good one. Yeah, it was really you good. You should take those guys on tour with you. I should, that would be my opening act. Donkey lips, remember that fat bastard? <laughs> we'll see after he's dead, by the way. He's not dead. I just, well, feel, I, I just feel like it's kind of like, because I'm a gay guy, everybody's right. like, oh, oh my God, right. you know? And it's that's that, it's kind of discriminatory in a weird way. It's fully discriminatory, and also... You're but like, I will know. say, and, and I'm not just being politically correct, I understand in the big picture things, right. I'm sure ABC and the producers of that show have a lot of pressure from both sides, mm. and I respect that they have to do what they have to do. That's almost sounded sexual to me. Pressure from both sides. Mm -hmm. Dare I say uh, a little bit gay? The door open. Gay. The door open both ways. <laughs> you know. Trust me, everyone who works on that show is gay. I'll yeah. guarantee it. Uh, uh, Adam. Maybe that's why. Maybe that's why. Maybe I it's self-loathing. Their wives were coming in tomorrow. Oh, okay. Do me a favor. Mm -hmm. Do me a favor. Mm -hmm. uh, my darling, I adore you, and thank you for joining us. And cheers. Cheers. Please come back soon. I will. We really love you, Ryan. Thank you. Really Likewise. You. That's been Adam Lambert. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bottoms up. <laughs>